What's up, YouTube? We have a K-Bar Classic. And this is going to be an unboxing. I haven't opened this yet. I got really, this is the 1180, and I got real lucky. This is like pristine condition. Holy cow. I'm going to shine this up real bright, get it back on the channel. Man, this is a serious piece. You see this piece, oh wow, that is, that is no joke, jumping. This piece is reflected in the K-Bar that was in D2 for, from SMKW for a while, the one with the clip, um, kind of like some of the box, the modern take. Kind of what is this? I do wonder if it sat in some oil and that's what we're seeing there. Not a not a diss to whoever sold me this. You might be watching. Thank you so much for the deal on this knife. Guys, I'm I'm really surprised at how solid a piece of gear this is. Wow. That is that, that is so solid. That is a what they call bank bank vault, right? It's so big it would never move. So so tight. I would bet that this sat in oil for a little bit. That's fine. That's not anybody's fault. When it comes to storing knives long term, you hear a lot of different things. That's why I don't use mineral oil. It can definitely... Wow. I'm not going to be able to use this. I mean, the knife, it's just... Uh, it's too nice. Wow, guys. All right. I don't know. I'll have another video up soon where I compare this to other things after I've cleaned it. This was an unboxing. That is super sharp. This thing is ready to field dress an animal. This is something that knows it's competing with the Buck 110. You know what I mean? Wow. It's a little cold. We're going to come back to this action. I'm not even worried about it, though, because anything cold, especially with this much metal on it, it's going to act a little slow until it warms up. I also haven't put any oil in it. All right, guys, thanks for sticking with me. That was not what I expected. That was a, That's very nice. This is a very nice piece. We're going to take one more look around it. Very cool. All right. This will be back on the channel. That's all she wrote for this one. Have a good rest of your day now. Bye-bye.